Hallo, meine Lieben! Und wir sind wieder... Oder immer noch... ...im Labyrinth. Aber... Das sieht so aus, als hätten wir den Weg schon gefunden. Das ist ja sehr lang, wenn das das war. Oh nein. <lacht> okay. Jetzt war das Ganze noch ganz einfach. Bisher noch recht in die Arme, würde ich mal schätzen und sagen. So. Crap. Which way do we go now? Ich nehme mal das, wo Ausgang dran steht. Also das rote Ding, ne? Das rote, da war nämlich das rote statt etwas Grünes. Wo ist das Ort, anyway? Der Ausgang. Ja? Was ist das hier überhaupt? <lacht> Okay, das war einfach. Where's the exit? What the hell is this place? It's an Earth pulse. Mm. So you survived. Let's not count our blessings just yet. It looks like we've been sealed inside. But at least we're still alive. Can't say the same would be true if we stayed in that place. A nerf So that's what this is. Yeah. It's like a river flowing with nature's life energy. Earth pulses can be found all over the world, but normally you can't see or interact with them. Then how'd we wind up inside one? When Inominat and Lafisette's power collided, the shock must have torn it open. If that's the case, it's possible that Lafisette possesses the power to return us home. But just <coughs> wach auf! He can't do much in this state. He's liable to turn into a demon any moment now. <coughs> Don't talk like that. Das machen wir aber nicht. Is this because he overused his powers? It's not too late to stop it. If a Moloch occupies a pure vessel, he can be prevented from transforming into a demon. Even you? This lucky coin is my vessel. There's a catch to this one, though. It can only serve as a vessel for someone with the Reaper's powers. Then that's no help at all. An exorcist would work. We offer our own bodies as vessels for Malachim, so that we can use them for the Abbey's purposes. I volunteer to serve as your Moloch's vessel. I see. So we just need your body with us, not your legs. Not one step closer! I'll kill myself before you lay a hand on me. The Moloch will become a demon, and you'll be stuck here forever. You don't mince words, do you? Know your foes and strike where they're weak. The basis of all combat. As cowardly as I'd expect from a disciple of Artorius. No, this is personal. Once I regain my exorcist powers, I vow to challenge you, Demon Velvet! If I lose, I'll do whatever you wish. If you want me to die or to become a vessel, so be it. <laughs> What 
What's the Malik's name? Normally, it is decided by their masters, but since I do not own him yet, I need to know. He's not a thing to be owned. He's Lafayette. <laughs> Lafayette. I see. O oh, child of the fountain of creation, these vows we exchange. May our purpose, resplendent, help to purify this cursed world. Remember this true name I bestow unto you. <clears throat> How the hell did we end up here? What's going on? That little brat! He actually unsealed the Earth Pulse? What was that? Huh. Guess this is the end of the Velvet World Tour Revengeathon. What an anticlimax. <laughs> Not that I really care either way. We don't know that she's dead. Dead or alive, she's done. No way she'd keep going after seeing how outmatched she is. Bet you ten gold that I'm right. Ten gold? You're on. What in the? Luffy said, what did that exorcist do? What happened to you? I see. So that exorcist woman pledged herself as Luffy Set's vessel? Where did she head off to then? If you two wound up here, then odds are that exorcist has appeared somewhere nearby. Then we'll find her. Sheesh, are you never not worked up about something? I said I would save him, so I will. Besides, his power is just what I need. Don't you forget our little wager now, all right? My darling Ted Gold, murdered in his crib by a thug! I won't let her get away from me! Ja, sie meinen, er guckt, drehen wir uns doch mal um, machen erstmal die Truhe auf. So exorcists are actually the vessels for their Malakim. You can do that too, can't you? Of course! This fair maiden has won the Malakim's Choice Award, Most Desirable Vessel, three years running! Oh? Then you wouldn't mind replacing Eleanor as Lafayette's vessel, I hope. Thanks! But no thanks. I have my hands full dealing with Bienfu as it is. If I ate Bienfu, you'd have room. Still wouldn't work, kiddo. You saw it with your own eyes. Even if only for an instant, that kid actually held his own against the power of Inominat. Not even the resplendent Mogilu can handle something of that power. Indeed. After everything we've seen, it's obvious there's more to Lafayette than meets the eye. Yeah, but that Eleanor woman was still able to become his vessel. That's because, unlike Miss Mogilu, Madam Eleanor actually tries! <laughs> Anyway, we need to find her and beat her. She'll just bring us more trouble the longer she's out there. Oh, we'll find her. No doubt about it.
this looks like some kind of ruin. Where are we? Judging from the style of the walls and columns, I'd say this place is an ancient underground temple of Eumacia. Eumacia, the Empyrean of Earth. So it was by no coincidence that the Earth Pulse led us here. How did the temple builders know where to dig to connect to an Earth Pulse? Did they just get lucky? Just wham, there it is? An Earth Pulse doesn't work that way. It's a flow of natural force ordinary humans can't sense. But in those days, there were more humans capable of sensing that which others couldn't. It was people like that who guided the rest to build their temples closer to the Earth Pulses. Closer to their gods. Uh-huh. So, since Empyreans control the forces of nature, people viewed the Earth Pulses as embodiments of the gods themselves. Is that it? Right. In the time when Empyrean worship was at its peak, temples like this were built all over. And I'm guessing they all looked pretty similar, so until we go outside, we're no closer to knowing where we are. That sums it up. Hmm. I wonder if they found any high-quality ore when they dug this hole. You know, for making swords. <sighs> I don't know why I bother explaining anything to you. You know, I'm starting to think you just enjoy it. <sighs> Oh, oh. Oh, ah! You guys again? Well, look who set up shop here. You couldn't have shown up at a better time. We need more supplies. I'm happy to help you all, but this time I really, really needs to charge a little extra. Wirklich? What extra are we talking here? Ooh, you haven't heard the stories, little turtles. Word has it, there's a spooky monster that's been eating traveling merchants around these parts. <laughs> eating merchants? She takes the shape of a black-haired girl, and when she finds greedy merchants, she gobbles <laughs> them up head first. Although, if the greedy merchant was a turtle's, I bet she'd start with the crunchy shell. Ah! I'm not greedy, I swears it. Look, I have special sales going on. Everything's marked down to normal prices. How generous of you. Magulu, give the nice turtles the smile he lives for. Always a pleasure. <laughs> Much obliged. <lacht> Dann organisiere ich mich kurz und ist wir gleich wieder da. Oh, da sind wir wieder. Ich, hab ein bisschen, ich bin ein bisschen hinterher gelatscht und habe auch einen heimlichen Gegner gefunden. Der ist auf dieser Karte ganz im Norden. Im Prinzip ist es ziemlich linear. Lachi, lachi, lachi. Hm, da ist sie schon. I thought you'd be long gone. I apologize for disappearing on you. I was there, and then in the next moment, I was gone. And Luffy said? He's resting inside me. As <coughs> far as I can tell, he seems healthy again. Your name's Eleanor, right? If I defeat you, you'll be his vessel and follow my orders until the day you die. I accept. But conversely, should you lose, I will take your life. Do you plan on fighting alone? I can handle myself. Thing. Kann man nicht gewinnen, glaube ich. Puh, der hat aber ganz schön schwer. We're done here. Never let her guard down, even when victorious. Yeah. This... Why did you stop? I know you can't kill me as long as I'm his vessel. I'm just abiding by the same terms. Had you won, you'd have killed me. True, but a duel is a duel. The Abbey shaped you well. However, 
Once your sword is drawn, never waver. Control your feelings to control the tide of battle, right? Lord Artorius's teachings? What a failure I have been. <laughs> I'll... I'll keep my word. I will follow your orders. To the day I die! Don't! My body... I can't move! How? Since when can a Moloch overpower his own vessel? Luffy said, are you feeling better now? Y yeah. Looks like her body is reacting to the bond. Yeah, I know the drill. She'll get a high fever and stay zonked out for a bit. No biggie. Carrying her will slow us down. We can't afford that risk when we're venturing into parts unknown. Let's rest here until she's recovered, then. She's one of us now, isn't she? As long as she's Lafayette's vessel. That's true. Oh, no, no. Hey, don't overwork yourself. I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? Isn't it obvious? I... I disobeyed you, Velvet. Don't sweat it. I'm still alive thanks to you. I just... I didn't want to see you die. That's why I... Why I did that. To save you. I'm sorry, too. Acting the way I did. Treating you like an object. When I came with you, that was my own choice. You gave me the freedom to choose. And what would you choose now? We only have more troubles ahead. You're still going to fight, aren't you? Na sicher. <laughs> yeah, I can't stop now. Even so, I've made my choice. I'm coming with you. I see. Anyway, it's not like I have any idea where we are now. That's a good point. Ha <laughs> ha! But an object misused is one thing. A person misused is quite another. What's your point? What's your point, is what I want to know. Not only did you blow the whole revenge thing, you didn't even leave a scratch. Do you have any plan on where to go from here? I'll admit it. The Nominat's power is far beyond what I could ever have imagined. But I'll never give up. No matter how many times I have to try, I'll devour them all. Bet you 100 gold you break first. Huh? You heard me. 100 gold says that you give up. I lost a bet with Rokuro when you had to go and survive. Cost me 10 gold. I'm just looking to come out on top. <laughs> Whatever, fine. Oh, be then fucked. it looks like we have a bet. There might be some fun in me sticking around after all. Not that I much care how it all turns out. I'm just looking to kill time. Hey, Velvet. I've got something that might help with Inominot. Oh, is this that book you took from the villa? It is. Look closely at the crest oh. on the cover. Yeah. It's the same one from the temple. Does that book say anything about Inominat? Yes. But I can't read it. It's written in the ancient tongue. Oh, don't cry, baby boy. 
My friend Grimoire might be able to decipher that for you. Really? Well, maybe, maybe not. She'd have to take a look first. Well, where is she? Your friend, I mean. No idea. The last letter I got from her was sent from East Salts down in South Gand. Not much to work with here. True, but I'll have fun watching you try. Oh, I'll find her. Don't you worry about that. That's the spirit. Don't give up just yet. <laughs> Nach South Gand müssen wir also. Super. Ah. We'll rest inside these ruins. You're still weak. Okay. Dann legen wir uns halt erstmal hin. atone for this grave sin. This is all I can do. Forgive me, Lord Artorius. <sighs> Communication art. I send Melchior to check out the Earth Pulse. And what a strange sight does he find. My lord, I have failed you. Lift your head, Eleanor. The Shepherd has a special mission for you. A special mission? You are to protect the Malak Lafiset and bring him to the Logris Abbey headquarters. Mm. This mission is highly classified, and not to be shared with even the Legates. Protect the Malik and bring him to the capital, then? With the utmost secrecy, your becoming his vessel is in fact quite fortunate. Maybe so. But with me as his vessel, the Malik may interfere. This Malik may have his own will, but he can be manipulated. Do whatever it takes to get the job done, Eleanor. You act under my full authorization. Even were it to mean obeying the orders of a demon? But, my lord, what Moloch could possibly be that valuable? Are you saying you cannot? Shame is only a fleeting emotion. It is will and reason that ultimately prevail in the face of calamity. My lord, I live to serve the principles of your teachings. The Earth Pulse will soon close. From here on, you must use your own discretion to execute your mission. <laughs> Sehr schön. You're up. How are you 
feeling? I'm fine. Listen, don't try anything like that again. Pain is... Pain is scary, right? I'm alright. No more running away. I'm Lafisa. It's good to finally meet you properly, Eleanor. Y yeah likewise. Don't worry. If you try running, you won't get far. Once I've eaten your arms and legs, I merely need you alive to act as his vessel. Nothing more. That won't be necessary. I swore an oath before our duel. An oath grants power in exchange for a certain constraint. Mine was, if I lose, I will obey my opponent. Once put in motion, an oath cannot be broken by the one who swore it. I will keep my promise to you because I must. Hmm. An oath, is it? In that case, I have a question for you. What does the Abbey plan to do with the Nominat? To wipe out the demons, of course. We want to end the era of disaster once and for all. And how exactly does the Abbey plan on wiping out the demons? Is the Nominat going to wander the land, slaughtering them all? They... They never told me. And Nominat's ritual is kept confidential even within the Abbey. All I know is that it involves Melchior. And it looks like the only way we'll figure out Nominat's true nature is by deciphering Lafisette's book. We'll have to track down Mogulu's friend, the one who can read the ancient tongue. If we go to East Sultan Southgand, we ought to find some clues to her whereabouts. But first, we have to figure out where we are now. We need to find a settler or a village. Something. <laughs> I'm surprised us chuckleheads even know our own name. Hmm? What's wrong? Lee. An enemy. <laughs> He's still moving. I'll take this one. That's it, yes. Stuck there, sure. Good a challenge. Ah, but I am underdog. Oh, ho, 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 Luffy! Don't interfere! Uh, what do you think you're doing? Touch me, I'll kill you. I'm sorry, I just got a little riled up. <laughs> do you know that demon? No, but I know his sword, a blade called Stormquell. Storm quell. Whatever. It doesn't have anything to do with us. Let's just get to the portal already. So, damit gebe ich zurück. Bis zum nächsten Video. Tschüssi.